My name is Erwin Tang, and I'm uh, the author of a new book called Gook, John McCain's Racism and Why It Matters. John McCain said, I hate the gooks. I will hate them as long as I live. He used the word gooks to refer to Vietnamese people for 27 years until he decided that it was going to put his presidential campaign in jeopardy. The word gook is also appropriate because it's a term of war. And it's, it's both a term of war and racism. And John McCain is very active in both areas. The United States Army soldier. The 1960s have brought him here to South Vietnam. The word gook um, was developed through 100 years of American invasions and massacres. Uh, the word gugu was used against the Filipinos when we invaded that nation and killed hundreds of thousands of Filipinos. That word transformed into gook in Haiti. So the word gook was actually first used on Haitians when we invaded that nation and were terrorizing the people there. Um, and then finally the Japanese, uh, the Chinese, the Koreans, and uh, most famously towards the Vietnamese, it's always a term of war. Uh, mo the most famous saying about gooks is the only good gook is a dead gook, which became the motto of the Vietnam War for many uh, veterans. And apparently John McCain picked that up and he came back to the United States using the word gook in the mass media. I mean, most veterans, when they come back to the United States, they don't use the word gook in public, much, much less in the mass media. They understand that uh, it's a racist term. It's a term that you use towards people that you're willing to kill. And so the term gook and his mentality show that John McCain uh, is willing to uh, sort of dehumanize uh, people of color, especially foreign peoples of color, um, in order to prepare them for American invasion. For instance, um, the Iranians, uh, which are our next apparent target, according to John McCain. He recently was told that a main export to Iran was cigarettes. And he said, well, maybe that's one way we can kill them. And he's also, of course, famous for seeing the song Bomb, 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 Iran. Bomb, Iran? <laughs> bomb, bomb, bomb. <laughs> hey, man. That just goes to show that these people, um, whatever people he may be talking about that he's preparing for us to kill, are subhuman. Um, and that, that's how gook connects people of color here, people of color around the world. I've been called gook a good number of times during my life. Gook and VC, Charlie, Kami, Jap, Chink, whatever. And it's usually when uh, one or more people want to physically assault me. If he had used the N-word to describe anyone, whether it was uh, people that he had uh, fought with in war or uh, people who had um, captured him in war or whatnot, we would not be considering John McCain. If he had used the N-word rather than the G-word, gook, we would have disqualified John McCain for the presidency immediately. <laughs> 